Alright everyone. I am not gonna lose this game. That is a guaranteed fact. We're playing Quest Hunter. So you can already tell that this is a 1000% promise. We're not gonna lose this game. And the fact that you're watching it right now, because I know you are, because we're not going to lose this game, just proves the fact that when we haven't lost this game, we've a thousand percent won, no matter what happens. We're versing a Star Lord. Never mind, we are completely screwed. Let the hunt begin. You know what? Warriors do like to rush things. And what beats rush? charge. That's right. We'll hold on to unleash the hounds just for now. Because uh, if this boy goes mad with power, we want to be able to uh, keep up. And unleash the hounds is perfect for both my quest and for sorting out fast decks. Okay. Interesting. We'll just hear a power for now. He hasn't made a move, we haven't made a move. Well, we've chosen to hero power. His hero power does counter mine pretty much exactly. So we'll just We'll just be chilling. We'll just be big chilling. Okay, okay. So far so good. I don't think I've made a misplay. I feel like I could have literally made a misplay at turn one, somehow. Like, I don't know how, but I feel like there's some random technical BS that I'm missing. And I've just somehow misplayed turn one, two, and three. I think that's good, though, because he's clearly saving up for a big drop. And if we can put that back in his hand and just tell him, screw you, buddy, I think that'll be great for us. What's he saving up to drop? He wants to drop the bomb on something. We'll just keep doing this. We have no reason to not do it. And now we're at turn six, or six mana, where we can start dropping Swarm of Locust. Welcome to the Grand Tournament, Champion. Oh, okay. Welcome to the Grand Tournament, loser. <laughs> Alright, let's make the full use of this. Get our quest going. Okay, Grand Tournament gets plus four armor instead of plus two. Not a bad start. That's what we get for playing wild. We get to see Justica Trueheart again. Now my new my next question is, is this a legendary only deck? It's, it's, it has potential so far, because it's only played one Legendary. But we do not know until it occurs. Alright, let's give ourselves Ysera. Maybe he'd just have as a quest to gain 10,000 armor or something ridiculous. Which is understandable. Oh, oh, oh. He's been holding on to that since turn one. Turn one, what is it? Go on then. Play it for us. Interesting. This this guy's just stalling. Maybe he's trying to keep my board roughly full so I can't summon anything else. That's pretty smart, but it also means that he can't do anything. Nothing amazing, anyway. He can gain armor. You didn't need that, did you? Please be dead. Yes! <laughs> I was gonna say, please be deadly shot. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Okay, but it's not a legendary only deck. Alright. Fuck it. We'll play you, Sarah. Why not? It'll force him to do something, even if it is just to waste and ex execute. Okay, because I doubt he can gain 12 armor and shield slam it. That's a pretty good one. 
Oh, I see. He's some sort of OTK deck. Potentially. There's the execute that we saw. Interesting. That's perfectly fine. Do it again. You won't. You don't have another whirlwind. He might have a uh, the other one though. Never mind. It's fine. That'll return to his hand. We can honestly just relax about that, or we can kill it off. That's another option. Uh, how we doing? Three more to go. So, I say we just get the three more. Ooh, yes. Let's do it. Let's get that hero power bumping. So we've got Unleash the Hounds if he goes wide, which is pretty much perfect tied in with this hero power. So now we're basically just seeing if we can outlast him until we can punch him in the face. Okay, so the chances are he's probably dead man's handed his own dead man's hand. And he's most likely trying to go infinite. Okay, unleash the hounds to help us out tremendously. Another soul to consume. Hmm. We won't do that just yet. But we'll keep it in mind. We'll hide behind our bone wraith for now, and then Ooh. Oh. Yeah, yeah, we'll hide behind our bone wraith for now and just build up this guy's attack. Ooh, interesting. Big boy Boomy. Oh, you shouldn't have done that one first. I suppose it's more value, but that's a big yikes. Big, big yikes. Oh, do you have many taunt minions? Okay. Uh, can we just win? No, probably not. Uh, let's see. We can summon six with both of them. But that's kind of useless to summon six. Let's be honest. Um, well, let's see what we've got. Seven damage. Eight, nine, ten, eleven. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Twenty damage at the moment. So, yeah, let's push. I feel like a lot of his strategy revolves on him having health. That's where I think our strategy is going to come into play. Killing him. Come on. Do you have another board clear? Oh, he does too. That's fair. Hopefully Bone Wraith doesn't win, but yes, yes, perfect. That's literally perfect. Bone Wraith stays, and we get a 5-1. Which is amazing for us. Please summon a bunch of minions. What's this do? Discover a mech. That's not going to save you now. Oh, that's not going to save you. No 4-drop mech is going to be able to clear this. Oh, actually, I, I might be speaking a little too soon. I think we've just about got this in the bag. Come on. Oh, he does have one mech. Damn, that was literally the best thing he could have done. Removed my board and his. Your feeble magic Leave it at that. Can't be targeted by spells or hero powers. 
That means no execute's gonna work on it. We can just build this boy up. Oh damn, you can use it twice, nice. Oh, wait, what? You didn't? Oh, damn, that's interesting. Um, well, I really don't know what to think about that. Let's do this. Find something with Rush, like Zilliax or Faceless Corruptor. So that we can bash through that guy's defense. Could just do that. That could work too. Nah. How about a Yeah, why not? We'll forget about our hero power this turn. I completely forgot about my hero power that turn. Okay, if we lose this, that's my fault. But if we win, it was it was extended BM. We all know it. That's how it goes. Okay, so we can take out the Draconoid, which kind of sucks. But how's he going to handle the Rush Boys? Oh, right, because we didn't stop that. Yeah, we really should have thought that one through, huh? To be fair, though, he's wasting his turn. Which is kind of what we want. Yes. Now use... Oh, I was gonna... No, I was gonna say use a spell on the last one. Damn it. Okay, but we still win. We still win. It's not a problem. We still win. It was extended BM. We all knew it. We all knew it. Okay? We all know it was extended BM. I'm just such a god that I did it like two turns earlier. Right? Ah, there's the sweet taste of victory. An interesting deck. I wanted to see what he was going to do with his dead man's hand, but apparently it was nothing. Alright. When all else fails, quest hunter. Alrighty. And I think we're going to buy ourselves a pack. Because we have, we, we have officially bought the uh, Battlegrounds Pass. So we can buy ourselves a pack. It's been a while since we've had a look at this. Oh, and you can buy the Eyes of Cthulhu card back. Which is a little bit dumb. Because 500 bloody gold? Hell no. Nah. We're going to go for... Ooh, what do we go for? I feel like I want more cards from Ashes of Outlands, to be honest. But, you know what? We'll get it, because that's what I want. Wait, no. What, what's the set that has the bombs? What set dropped bombs? The Boomsday Project? I presume it's the Boomsday Project, but... You know what? We'll get to crafting those later. For now, we'll just buy ourselves... A classic pack. You know why that is? Because I'm more likely to get dust this way, because I've almost completed my classic set. At least for the commons and rares. Whoa, my game is lagging. What the hell is this? Come on, game. You're better than this. Give me Ragnaros. Everybody agrees that I should get Ragnaros. Okay, so I'm fairly certain I've got two of this rates and loot hoggers and flesh-eating ghouls. Maybe not mind games, uh, but that should all pretty much be turning into dust. Please tell me most of that has turned into dust. Yeah, four commons. Okay, so I've finished out the commons for the classic packs, which means I can basically now choose between getting new cards or getting 20 dust, which isn't bad, but at the same time isn't great, so I, at least we have our options open to us. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed smashing that warrior, whatever deck he was using, and I'll see you all in the next one. Take care, guys.